Hey, what's up? Thug Booty here, and I wanted to talk about the new YPP program for YouTube. Now, if you follow anyone like Moist Critical or Asmongold, you'll know that Twitch is really just shooting itself in the foot. And then you see streamers like XQC and Amaranth switching over to platforms like Kick, or many of these big streamers are now looking for other platforms to jump ship from Twitch. And YouTube is capitalizing on the many pitfalls that Twitch is running into, all the stumbling that Twitch is doing uh, with their content creators, lowering the threshold on when you could get monetization for your channel. Creators can now qualify to apply to YPP and unlock benefits like select features with YouTube shopping and fan funding at the following thresholds. 500 subscribers, in addition to three uploads in the last 90 days, in addition to no active community guideline strikes, and one of the following. 3,000 valid public watch hours in the last 365 days, or 3 million valid public shorts views in the last 90 days. Now this does not include ad revenue, um, but what it does include are things that benefit streamers the most, uh, and that would be your donation tab or your membership tab, as well as super chats. Lower eligibility criteria that will offer earlier access to promoting your own products on YouTube shopping and fan funding features like super thanks, super chat, super stickers, and channel memberships. Now, I think YouTube's game is a little bit different than most other platforms. They are targeting with this update right here to get more fresh faces, newer content creators onto their platform uh, and making it more of a space for those newer content creators or newer streamers versus kick paying out, you know, a hundred million dollars to get established streamers or the failure of Mixer buying out all those higher end streamers. And this gives more of an incentive to cast a wider net while also giving newer content creators an opportunity to grow their business, as well as as YouTube offering a better percentage of revenue than Twitch does, um, where Twitch is trying to take more and more money from their content creators, which is what keeps their platform alive. YouTube is trying to give more to the content creators, obviously trying to build up a content base. Now, I do have some gripes with YouTube. Uh, YouTube does have a weird algorithm. It does, it's not quite set up for streaming. Most people who go onto YouTube don't go on to watch streams unless, you know, you're Dr. Disrespect. Are you kidding me? However, what YouTube does do, and this is something that I have taken uh, full advantage of, is it immediately uploads your VOD and you also can stream in higher quality than you can on Twitch by increasing your bit rates and not having to be a partner to do that. Find me a spool, then let's talk. Oh, she probably has spools. <laughs> Predicted. I, as a small content creator, I get a lot of my views from past streams because they do show up as an uploaded video, being that most people who watch YouTube like to watch the videos on their own time it is great for getting more and more viewership as well as more subscribers. So what YouTube has done is they've cut the threshold from a thousand subscribers to 500 subscribers. And then your total watch time is 3000 hours uh, versus the usual 4000 hours. And this doesn't eliminate that 4,000 hour, 1,000 subscriber threshold. Once you hit that 1,000 subscribers and that 4,000 hours, you then get ad revenue. Uh, but this is a great way to bridge the way to ad revenue. So I think right now is the best time. If you are a new streamer, it's the best time to jump in and start streaming on this platform. And uh, yeah, short video, that's all I got for you. Uh, Thanks, and I hope you have a swell day.
See ya. You're never gonna make it. You're not good enough. There's a million other people with the same stuff. You really think you're different, man. You must be kidding. Think you're gonna hit it, but you just don't get it. It's impossible. It's not probable. You're irresponsible. Too many obstacles. You gotta stop it, yo. You gotta take it slow. You can't be a pro. Don't waste your time no more. Who the fuck are you to tell me what to do? I don't give a damn if you say you disapprove. I'm gonna make my move. I'm gonna make it soon. And I'll do it because it's what I wanna fucking do. Because all these opinions and all these positions, they come in in millions. They block in your vision. But no, you can't listen. That shit is all fiction. Because you hold the power as long as you're trying to make it. There's no way that you make it And maybe you can fake it Tears running down my face with a big ass smile because I, I wasn't sure if I was happy or sad Make them take it all back Don't tell me you believe that Are you just gonna take that Or will you fucking fight back I'm done playing. I'm not. I don't want. I don't want to fight anymore. We're done. I'm better than you. 